let's get into it though. Let's see what it takes to get these invincible tools. You see who's here. We got a Mecha Okafor here, Michael Red. I mean, I don't know. This content looks kind of kind of still. We got Jason Kidd, Alonzo Mourning, Stefan Marbury. We got a Amare Stoudemire. It's a lot here. I mean, we still haven't reached Kareem. I want to do a video with Kareem. I keep getting bounced on by Kareem. Kareem keep bouncing on my head top. You know what I mean? I mean, no, no pause, pause, no pause. Something like that. Okay. Uh, here are the agendas. This is what you got to do for the, for the USA 2 agendas. In order to get an equal chance invincible back, I mean, and hopefully you don't get an undersized guard. You know what I mean? Either way, these are 99 overall cards, 99 everythings. So, I mean, take that as you want, as you will. Get two blocks in a game with the Heat player seven times. Score 14 points in the paint in a game with the Spurs player seven times. Score 57 points with a Bucks player in a game. Get 10 double-doubles over multiple games. Get 25 assists with Maverick players over multiple games. Score 50 points with Nets players over multiple multiplayer games. I mean, it's no way for me to recycle stale content, but those are the agendas for USA 2. Let's see what's on the market for USA 2. The pack market is looking invincible. At The pack market is looking invincible at the moment. I don't know if I just recorded all that. I mean, I hope so. I would hope so. Yeah, it looks like about three minutes worth. I was, yeah, I, I was yapping for about three minutes. Either way, um, a box. Do we open a box? A 10 box of these? What do we, what do we do with these? These look discounted. Matter of fact, these are a discount. There's a discount to this. About 20K. I see about 20K VC discount. They're usually 99. This is 71. So at least that's that. They did take our, our nod to that. About 100K off of the, uh, okay. Okay, 2K, I see you trying. I see you trying. I see you trying. I'm still not opening the 20 box. It's not going to happen. Oh, shit. Oh, um, shit. Maybe a 10 base at this point. I'm waiting on things to happen. I'm waiting on something to shake. I'm not going to hold you. And you know I don't open this agenda-based content. But for the fact that we don't get these cards, these invincible cards are not attainable, which means you cannot get these cards through agendas, all of them. These are not the same as, well, no, okay. With the older agendas, they were one equal chance card or you can get the top dog out of the, out of the box. If you do the agendas, these are not like those. So for the fact that these are not like the others, I will bust a few of these, but I don't suggest you open any of these. You don't necessarily need these cards. As you see, I just pulled a pink diamond out of this box. A new pink diamond. This is a pink diamond that I do not have. Oh, wait a minute. I thought I had Shea Gildress. Maybe I put him in a pack. We may have packed up Shea Gildress a long time ago. This is NBA Series 2 Shea Gildress. So who knows? Maybe we packed him up. Maybe we never pulled him. Who knows? Nowhere close to collector level. I do have an idea though. I scripted out what it would take to get to collector level. I'm about 500 cards away. And it would take... Um, uh, it would take a lot of MT in the pack market. It would take a lot of MT in the pack market, in the player market, whatever you want to call it, whatever it's called. I mean, I call it bring us back our auction house. But for that, it would take it would take a whole lot of you know, I haven't calculated how much I'm not a scientist and I'm not about to calculate how much MT it would take. But I, I believe about a million, maybe 500 K MT. I'm not sure. But I do want to toy with the idea of maybe getting all of the gold cards off the auction house. I mean, off the uh, agendas and then like doing something like that to to maybe get to collector level. Being 500 cards away, it's no telling if I'll get there or not. But I'm toying with the idea. I mean, we sitting on a little bit of that MT thing, 1.5 mil. So. I'm just racking that up in case Kobe, maybe Kobe comes across, you know what I mean? Maybe, uh, maybe something like that happens. Okay. What I did was I went to these gold cards here and I'm like, it's, it's roughly like 300 of these gold cards, 300 of these joints. And the prices vary. The highest price I was seeing was like 5k. So I was calculating in my head, doing a little rough summary in my head, like what it would take 
to really get to all these cards, how much MT it would take. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. I'm really not sure what it would take. So I don't know. Either way, we got to do something. We can't just sit around here and not have, but it's not really, is it worth it at this point? At this point, is it worth it? Because it's a lot going on at this point. We, we're getting close to hopefully Kobe comes out, like I said. But let's look at a few of these cards right here. It's a few of these. Stefan Marbury, undersized, 6'2", um, 70 Hall of Fame badges, 99 everything as we see. Uh, animation base. Let's see what animations broke. Got Derek Rose jumper. So his jumper is broken. We can tell that his jumper is broken off the rip. Derek Favors upper release. Um, yeah, he might be somebody to play with. Trey Young escape. You know, I'm looking for a three hunter. Trey Young escape is good for a three hunter. Chris Paul moving step back. I'm not looking for this card to be anything too crazy. Let's move on. Jason Kidd, uh, six four point guard, shooting guard. Mm. All of these cards gonna have seventy Hall of Fame badges, ninety nine everything, which makes these cards dangerous. Any one of these that you pull will be a hit rock. Don't get me wrong. Don't, don't let me, don't let me talk about these cards like they ain't nobody. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm looking for three hunters that'll be easily, easy to move around the floor with. And, and then again, at the same token, I'm looking for somebody with Penny Hardaway height. I'm looking for somebody with, you know, somebody that's up in, up above the rim. Trey Young escape is not moving me on these cards, but uh, Chris Paul moving step back. Um, I mean, Jason Kidd on very quick. I don't know what his jumper hits like, but 12 dunk packages, default small. Eh, Emeka Okafor. Emeka Okafor with 70 Hall of Fame badges, 99 everything. Like we said, animation based. Looking for Kobe Bryant escape move. Emeka Okafor. What is his... uh? Michael Porter Jr. and Klay Thompson might be an all right jumper. I'm not sure what that hits like. I mean, I would love to know what that hits like. I'm just not moved by these, these USA cards at this point. It's a few of them that I'm liking. And Michael Red is one of them. The jumper is a little bit of a, a guessing game. I mean, you would have to find out. You have to F, you would have to F around and find out. You know what I'm saying? Um... I do not know who, oh, Leandro Bolmore, Moro, Bolmoro. I don't know him. I'm not familiar with that man's game. I don't know what that jumper hit like either. We're looking for Kimball Walker escape. Oh, I would have loved to have, I would have loved to have Trey Young escape on this card. I guess they was thinking on their feet. They was like, we can't give them everything. Um, I mean, look for this card to be a hit rock though. With 99 everything at this point in the game, you can't miss Amare Stoudemire out here with 99 everything 70 70 badges 70 hall of fames i mean i'm not, i mean amare on very quick we i used amare earlier in the cycle he's all right his jumper was all right um i think chris bosh jumper is a little better trey young escape move i'm liking that uh I, I mean i'm seeing john wall step back there's a lot of pro in these cards I've been looking at a lot of pro in these cards so far, and I'm not. Alonzo Mourning, another undersized center. Undersized center for you. I mean, if that's what you feel like running with, I mean, I would really, uh, I mean, come on. They gave us they gave us a little bit of a hit rock in Kareem Abdul-Jabbar being level 40. So how, how, how far is this card going to take you? You know what I mean? How far are these bigs going to take you when you have a GOAT that you're looking forward to? Once you get to level 40, Scottie Pippen and Kyle Korver. Scottie Pippen lower base is not bad. I'm not sure. I haven't ran with Scottie Pippen this year. I'm, I'm to be honest, I don't know what it hits like. Escape move on Trey Young. A lot of pro again. Combo moves, breakdowns, moving behind the back. John Wall moving step back. Um, LeBron James lay a package with 12 dunk packages on him. I'm looking for this card to be a bust. I don't know. I mean, all these cards are strong, though. Don't get me wrong. All of these cards are, are definitely strong cards, but not cards. They're just not cards I'm looking for at this point in the game. Um, a, Ru a Ruby prize ball is not bad. These prize balls be paused. They be getting to it. Um, salary cap is one game mode I want to get into if you're looking for what to uh, hustle towards because you get this Mitch Richmond. I think this Mitch Richmond card would be 
uh, way better than Michael Red or any of the cards dropped. I think that a lot of these um, prize cards are the ones. These are some of the guys. DeMar DeRozan, my, his jumper smooth. I got to him already. I'm waiting to get to Tim Duncan. But, um, I mean, let's just go into freestyle to talk about it if you want to for a second. Who's on my squad? If we look at my squad right now, this is just what I'm running. This is just what's working for me. Um, I beg of you to let me take the time to put Chris Bosh in that lineup also. I don't know if I showed you James Harden. I'm pretty sure I did in the last video. James Harden is smooth. Chris Bosh, Chris Bosh ain't bad. I mean, the jumper is not bad. I haven't floored him. I think uh, in triple threat, I've been using him in triple threat to get these USA jerseys. And he's not a bad card. The jumper is smooth. The jumper is pretty smooth. Once you get space and it's not it's not a slow, there's no hitch to it. And he actually can move, you know, for 99, 99. The only thing is, I mean, he could be power forward too for me. For me, he could be power forward too, but I'm not looking for too much. And I mean, 20 unlimited games. That's all you got to do is win 20 unlimited games to get bro. If you can do that, then you got you a hit rock of a power forward out here. I haven't put a shoe on him because he's not, I'm not sure if he makes my team at this point. I just got too much. I got too much going on at the time and I'm too comfortable in my team to really put him in a lineup. I mean, as you can see, this is just how I'm rocking right now. We got this Kareem. We got, we, we messed around and pulled this unfazed Kareem. And that's just how we rocking until we get to level 40. It's taking a we're, we're creeping and crawling towards 40. I think we at what level 31 so far. And it's, I mean, it, it was just making the journey at this point, taking my time. Hopefully we get a Kobe because that's really what I'm waiting on. Like I told you in the beginning of the video, I'll open the video with hopefully we get a Kobe before we drop NCAA and it's getting close. It's cutting, we're cutting ties. But I mean, I just want you to know that I do, I do have that NCAA football pre-ordered in this thing. You know what I mean? It's, it's right here. We waiting, we're there. I even got the bundle. I got the bundle. So we got, we got, we got both games. You know what I mean? If we want to be honest, we have uh, both games waiting on you. So I want you to weigh in in the comment section. What would you like to see out of, out of NCAA football? What teams would you like to see? What uh, game modes would you like to see most? Just so I can get a better handle on uh, what type of content y'all want to see from that. And then Madden also. So definitely I'm, I'm feeling like we're going to do a, uh, gonna create a player and you know bring him through the ranks and see what we can do with him and then take him into you know into the 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 madden leagues you know what i mean take him from college to pro do a thing like that but right now right now it's a toss-up it's a toss-up paulo paulo blank blanquero is him dennis robin is him um so far as i can see DeRozan is him love is him I'm looking for some more bigs, though. I'm looking for bigs, though. So we know for sure we're going to get to that level 40 and we're going to get an upgraded Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. It's just a thing of what's going to happen in between now and then with the lineup. You know, what? with all of these Team USAs dropping and then we get new content tomorrow, I believe, or Friday. I don't know which day the content's supposed to come. How long do we have left before the content drops? Let me Let me check this out. Let me check this out. Um, where will, how will we check that out? How, I'm, I'm, oh, um, uh, fireworks two days. Okay. So between now and two days, two days, we should drop some more content on, um, on these joints. Let's just drop a 21, 21, 21, 21. See what we can get out of firework pack. Can we get go Luca out of single pulling? Nope. Ain't going to happen. Patrick Mills. And of course, that's who we wanted to see. That's exactly a duplicate card that we, I mean, come on, bro. We're not even getting closer to, at this point, it's like 2K be laughing at us. And that's why I'm not really, I'm not really too enthused on the theatrics and whatever else is going on. But I had to bring y'all that. Y'all see what the uh, agendas are. Y'all saw what the cards look like. Got a little idea of what the content going to look like going forward. What I need you to do is like the video, subscribe to the page because we're doing things and we're trying to do some more things and the only way we can do some more things is if you hear with the you know what i mean with the come ons and the get up and you know what i mean but uh yeah let me stop trolling y'all get out my face kobe your booze mean nothing i've seen what makes you cheer